A disturbing story involving a juvenile taken from her home in Honduras and ending up here in the Bay Area. Authorities say she was kidnapped, sexually assaulted multiple times, and forced into prostitution. NBC Bay Area Cheryl Hurd joins us from the Santa Rita Jail in Dublin, where two suspects are in custody. Cheryl. That's right, Raj. Both suspects are here at the Santa Rita Jail facing multiple sexual assault charges and kidnapping. Now, it all stems from a human trafficking case involving a 17-year-old girl. It ended here in early October, the arrest of these two people in this San Leandro home. Police say a 17-year-old girl was smuggled into the U.S. from Honduras, sexually assaulted, and held up in a shed in the backyard. Court documents say 41-year-old Juan Aguilar was in Honduras when he threatened the 17-year-old girl at gunpoint, telling her if she reported the crime, he would kill her grandmother. The alleged threat turned into multiple sexual assaults and a kidnapping. Police say she was sold in Honduras to a human trafficker and later reunited with Aguilar in the U.S. here at his San Leandro home, where he lived with 39-year-old Margaret Wilson. Police are calling her his wife. I haven't had time to really process the information, but it's crazy. That's disturbing. Yeah. Very disturbing. I have daughters that are getting up in that age and it makes you want to think twice. This case has veteran police officers shaking their heads, telling me off camera it has been tough to investigate. In fact, the case led them to San Francisco, where they say Aguilar's wife groomed the 17-year-old to be a prostitute on the street. I think it's creepy, very creepy. I think that uh, something like that don't happen around this kind of neighborhood. Now, police say that they got a break in the case when the 17-year-old confided in Aguilar's niece. Both women went over to San Francisco to report the crime to authorities there. Reporting live in Dublin, I'm Cheryl Hurd, NBC Bay Area News.